Hi, my name is Abise Balogbo. I'm a makeup artist, a special effect makeup artist. Uh, so, truth be told, I never saw season one, right? I was on another project when the producer called me and said, hey, Abise, so you're going to be on this project, blah, blah, blah. So I had to go and watch the season one to know what is going on. And whew, it was hot. Does he sleep with you? Sure. Ah! Fire Tade, we have a deal. You need me here, Liu. Not in your bed. And I was so interested and I was happy. Then I started reading season two script. I'm like, okay, all right. This is gonna be fun. Right, so, uh, and I got to set. Everything is going on smoothly. Production team is on point. <coughs> So I'm going to start with the, the cast and crew. The cast and crew have been a blessing. We've been largely all right. Like the, the cast has been fantastic. The crew. Fantastic, like I call them like El Clasico. They make, they're a gift to me as a producer because as a producer, you, you, you need people who want to work with you and not people are going to be working against the, the plot. So. 8 p.m. and 4 slate, 71. Coming on the set of well baby too, I was always expecting it to be tasking, expecting it to be a blast. Because the first season I heard, because I was in there, I heard was was tasking, but they pulled it over and then you can see the beauty they created. So coming here, I felt like I was going to see the same creativity and I have seen people really working hard, really being creative, putting down their intellectual property for the best results on this uh, project. I feel, yeah, there have been setbacks, but man, having a great team has been one of the strongest suits of uh, this LBB season 2 series. That thing with Tali was completely out of. director Belinda Yanga is one of the female directors in the industry that I can tell you I really respect and admire because she she knows what she's doing she knows what she's doing so when I got the script for the season two of uh, Little Black Book I was excited I was really excited working with her again because whenever I'm coming on set to work with her. Literally, I come with a jotter and a pen because there's always something to learn from her. 12, 19, 21, slate, 12, take one, pick up. Surprise! <laughs> Thanks. You give Radio Girl belly. Eh? Guy. <laughs> Every night after shoot, when we get uh, our call sheets, I have to like go through the whole call sheet, go through the scenes we'll be filming for the next day, 
sort out continuity pictures and send it, send them out to other departments like uh, wardrobe and makeup. You know, so we won't have issues on set. And action. One more time. Get your hands off me, are you mad? Get your hands off, move! Get moved! You stop, 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 you <laughs> and even after that, you know, it's work. Sometimes people get tired. You do all of that and when you come on set, you realize that you have to do the same thing all over again. I'm eating good food. <laughs> I'm eating good food, you know. I'm sleeping well, but I mean, it's production, it's film. We are here to work. Yeah, and I like the cast. They are so cool. Like we dance, we vibe. Give me some. And then again, we go back to the work and we're serious. When, it, when we need to like finish our scenes, we are <laughs> ready to go, you know. to miss the cast and crew. We've had a ball, even though um, so, sometimes we've not had the most, um, we've not had the most, uh, I'm looking for the word, I'm sorry, my brain is kind of scattered right now. <laughs> I think one of our superpowers is the fact that we have a dream team. You know, whether it's the cast, whether it's the crew, we are, we are all on the same page. We know that we have the same goal. We know that we want to create this top-notch content that we can show to the world and be proud of. And where we're going is basically to continue to churn out these fantastic uh, productions that not just Nigerians are proud of or just, not just Africans are proud of, that the world is eager to see because they are guaranteed of the level of quality that we are bringing out. So one thing I will miss the most about the experience of this production is uh, I think the bonding with some of the crew members, yes, I connected well with some of the crew members and I'm going to miss that. <laughs> The production team are a they are a classic act. I actually feel like that could be like uh, uh, LBB season three. <laughs> Thank you for how much you guys have invested. I could not have asked for a better crew this morning. I mean, I know how much I've stressed you guys, but how much production has stressed you guys, but yes, you still give us your 100%. Ah, food. <laughs> I think I'll miss the food. 
I think I would miss the producer. She's so cute and very fun to work with. So you guys, thank you so much for your work. Thank you for everything that you've done. Thank you for your patience because it can't be easy to be working the way we have been working for the past 12 days. It can't be easy. There's no, look at my eyes. I think I would miss my team members because those guys, I love them so much. And then, like the entire crew, basically. And cast. <laughs> and cast, yes. I'll miss everybody, I think. Yeah. I'm, I'm looking for the word. We've not, we've, it's not always been rosy, but we found a way to, to get along and be happy in the midst of, of, of all the drama of production. You know the regular drama of production, then multiply it by five. <laughs> I'm, going to miss, I'm going to miss the actors. They have been so helpful. Uh, and um, the crew, I mean, the crew don't, they don't make you feel the, uh, the, the stress. Even when we're being stressed, we're joking while being stressed, so it helps to reduce the stress. Okay. Don't sound, please. Show camera. Oh, okay, what's the question? Wait, wait, wait. Yes, yes, go outside. Go outside. Today's Friday. Go outside. Oh. Thank you. Thank you. Let's go. I wouldn't work with any other team apart from this one. Of course, anytime, any day, LBB comes calling. I will be no. there. Yeah, I love LBB. I love the production. I love everything about LBB. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> I mean, you can see from the people that we work with, it is <laughs> an absolute delight to work with these people. They're creative, they are crazy, they're funny, they're fun and they definitely have made this um, working experience a fantastic one and i'm not just saying this because i'm you know ep on lbb uh lbb2 um i did work with a lot of these people for our best friend's wedding and i was a cast member so i totally again from uh, remove me moving me from an ep's perspective i can definitely uh testify to how wonderful uh, these people are and I cannot wait for you guys to see LBB2. My goodness, um, I was on set a couple of times and I was just amazed at what we've been able to come up with despite, you know, all the things that are happening around us right now in Nigeria. We're still making it happen. It's a I'm happy, you know it's going to pay good production. So you guys should watch out. Cause it will be banging. Oh, good life.